Now we're going to use the terrain add back on fill command in order to generate the slope of terracing on the terrain surface. For this purpose, we need to draw a curve that must be planar and closed at uh, the tool we use for this operation. So first, we go to the top viewport to run the curve command. We make sure the project on map point is on in order that that curve doesn't pick uh, wrong uh, points at different elevations. So we define this curve. We need to move it up in order that we make sure it intersects with the terrain. So let's move it, for example, uh, 0.3 meters. And now we can run the cotton fill command that can be either found under the terrain toolbar or also from the edit panel. So remember that to select the terrain. And here in this edit section, select terrain, add cotton fill. And first, we need to define the slope uh, angle that will be defined around the curve used for this operation. So 60 degrees is fine. And finally, pick the curve. So now, if we select the terrain and we uh, decrease the cell size in order to appreciate better the operation, we can see that uh, part of the terrain has been removed and some other has been added in order that uh, it fits with the, uh, with the curve that was provided. Also, this operation has been stored under the input data, so we can select it, remove it at any time, or change the slope angle that we define it when we created it. Also, when we activate the control points on that terrain, we have now the control points of the, uh, the curve used for this operation.